I've been consistently conservative all the time, from the very beginning. She was, depending on your point of view, either a staunch ally or a formidable foe. The founder of the Eagle Forum, Phyllis Schlafly, died this week at age 92. In this 2007 interview, she wore a pin that was a memento of her World War II job, testing ammunition at the small arms plant while a student at Washington University. Twenty years later, she gained national prominence with her 1964 book, A Choice, Not an Echo. But it was the national campaign to block ratification of the Equal Rights Amendment that earned the St. Louis native her place in history. It's an incredible story of winning against overwhelming odds, because we had the presidents against us, Nixon and Ford and Carter, all the governors, all the media, all those organizations, Hollywood, and uh, we beat them all.